Hylos is getting experimental adjustments in the advanced server in all of its skills. And it's confusing whether it's better now or worse. Let's try to figure it out in this video. Hi guys, Kazuki here and in this video we will be playing a match with Hylos and also compare his skills in the original and the advanced server. As you guys know, this video has redeem codes and I want to congratulate the winners of our previous video. Thank you for participating. And similarly, this video will have hidden codes too. Find it from the video and redeem it at kazukiofficialstore.com and your diamonds will be delivered instantly. I'm going to be playing as Rome for our team. First, let's talk about his ultimate. The developer said that they buffed his ultimate. But when we look closely and think of it, it's like it got adjusted. Why? The slow effect is increased by 5% in the first 1 second while it has been reduced in the later part by 45% which is a lot. The new ultimate slow will be good especially when we chase heroes like Kimi11 since we can catch them up more easily. It's like they put the slow effect in the first shot and reduced it in the latter part. While in the original server, the slow effect is 70% for a straight 6 seconds. The ultimate duration, HP region, increased movement speed and slow immunity remained unchanged. What is this Mia talking about? Fredrin is getting cornered in the top lane, let me try to be there ASAP to give backup. Good one since we get one and now we can also get the turtle while he respawns. While we are busy taking turtles, the enemies are taking our mid lane turret. Let's get them. The Ling wants a piece of me. Let's show him. And now he's the one running. If you're looking for a hundred percent safe and secure diamonds, Kazuki Official Store is here to fulfill your need. We are trusted by more than 100 KMLBB players from India, Philippines, and Europe. Do visit our website and browse between various packs. I got their audit and I would have survived if my teammates didn't attack me. I lose most of my HP from there. And this is even for you guys. If glue is attached to one of your teammates, make sure not to attack him since your teammates also gets a lot of damage from it. Next, we will talk about his skill too. The base damage of his skill is reduced by 50 points in the late game. I guess the developers want to reduce the performance of high lows in the late game while other remains the same. High lows is a tank but can give you nightmares to a squishy hero with his second skill. And the skill is nerfed but is still enough to kill the enemy mage. Let's now talk about his skill 1 which got a huge adjustment. It will no longer stun the enemies directly but you will have to tap it and use the basic attack. 
Tapping the skill will increase your movement speed and enhance the first basic attack. You will get 50% movement speed which will decay over 3 seconds. Using the enhanced basic attack will stun the target for 1 second while knocking them back slightly. The developer said they did this because despite having more legs than others, he still lacks mobility. So they added a new effect where skill 1 will increase movement speed. I really like this since it can come in many uses. Especially when rotating around the map, it will be an easy task for him after the update. Or even escaping the enemies or even chasing them. Thought I could do something, my bad. It was a good trade 245 while I got a triple kill. Like I said, the new skill one makes chasing the enemies a lot easier. I somehow managed to survive thanks to his skill 1. Let's take the load and end while we can. Whoa, the healing. What do you guys think about the adjustments? I think the ultimate is a bit weak, but I guess a skill one will be able to fill up the gap. Do comment down below. And before ending this video, I want to give a big shout out to Ali Faima, Dominic Chang, Limbs Gaming, Jevithan Kali, and Mambavai Ralte. So that will be all for this video. Thank you guys for watching. Keep supporting Kazuki Official.